All right, part two of the 94 to 97 Ford F-250 pickup with the three-quarter or one-ton axle um, and the um, hub-mounted seals, not the spindle-mounted seals on the half-ton pickups. So anyway, when you do this seal and you remove it, um, when you remove the hub from the uh, spindle, you'll notice this part of the seal will stay on if it's original. And this will be on the... Um, spindle. You'll notice actually this will be like free floating behind this. It'll be like, yeah, it'll be like this. And then this will be on the front and you won't even think that this comes off, but it does come off. It's, it's really hard to pry it off, but it does come off. So you have to remove that to uh, properly put the new seal on, which will probably look like this. This is a sterling axle. This is the new seal as you'll get it um, in a box like this. And um, anyway, as you install this seal, you want to make sure, uh, after you clean everything up, make sure that you don't leave this little um, um, slinger out. This keeps the oil supposedly off the seal, I guess, and keeps it from maybe coming out too fast uh, from around the uh, bearing as it's spinning. But what I like to do is I use some of this Permatex, and I've already installed it, but just figured I'd show you real quick. Take this Permatex and put it around the, uh, this is the non-hardening type, around the outside of where the seal goes in, not the inside. And then you make sure you put the seal on correctly. You know, typically, you'll notice this side just looks like it faces outside. This is the oil side. It is actually marked on there. Oil side, somewhere on there, right there. This, of course, is the oil side this way. So that needs to face in this way, like that. Make sure that slinger is in there. And then what I do is I take a big old block of wood, and what we call is a um, BFH hammer, a big old uh, hammer. And then you uh, carefully, you got to feel it, make sure it goes in straight, and um, job done. And then when you're done, take some oil, of course put it around the circumference of the seal on the inside, because um, that needs to go on and not screw up that surface. And that's it. You're all done. All right.